Yes, yes, and we're here now. Did you know that the Ghana National Museum has recently been renovated? I saw some interesting pictures online and thought, hmm, this looks like a cool place for me to visit. So I'm going to be sharing a very short video of my experience. Hopefully, it would inspire you two to go out there to visit the museum. Of course, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. See you in the next video. This is my favorite part of the museum. The museum has a ground floor and a top floor. There is a really cool design of Anansi, aka Spider, and its web. Now here is why you need to visit the Ghana National Museum. There is so much to see. From the north to the south, east to the west, there's at least one or more artifacts showcasing each region in Ghana. For example, this section showcases the rite of passage in Ghana. The fabulous mannequin you see right here shows how young crop of girls dress during their puberty rites known as Dipo. Don't get lost, come with me! Now this is a display of an old school traditional Ghanaian kitchen. Do you see anything familiar? Do you want a feel of Ghanaian royalty? Well check this out. Here is a display of a northern chief. Also, a section that shows how kente is weaved in Ghana. Behold a beautiful display of Ashanti royalty. Guess what? There's an amazing gallery showcasing art from different talented artists. Check this one of our current president, President Nana Akufu Addo. If you're an art lover, then prepare to be entertained in this cool gallery. Now come with me and let's go upstairs. Of course the Black Stars had to make an appearance at the museum and as you can see football is definitely not my calling.
Ghanaian music has been popping for a long time now and here is a section dedicated to the famous Osibisa band to prove it. Any challenger? Who can beat me at this game called Owari? Let me know in the comments. The top floor also has some other lovely perks. When you visit, be sure to check out these interesting Ghanaian monuments. Plus, you can learn a bit about Ghanaian currencies and stamps over the years. Hooray, you made it to the end of the video. Now, thanks for watching. But before we wrap up, check out this cool bulletproof vehicle, which was apparently owned by Ghana's first president, Osajifu Dr. Kwame Nkrumah.